Raise your hands quickly, and then we'll get you guys questions. We'll start with Matt. Looking at the film, uh, obviously they've changed coordinators, changed coaches. What are the, I guess, big differences between last year's Mississippi State offense and this year? Um, I would say the big thing that stands out the most after watching a little bit of the tape was, was that, you know, they threw the ball mostly every play last year against whoever they play against us, against everybody else. So I feel like this year they're running the ball a lot more and missing in and becoming more of a fantasy offense. Charlie? Uh, just how much do you think the defense is starting to settle in and play like the group that maybe you'd expect early in the season? Um, I feel like we're just coming all together, playing fast and physical. Everybody being on the same page. Everybody knowing their role and playing their role. Just everybody doing their job. So I stand. Anything else, Kennington? Terry Young's come on and really started to play well the first few weeks of the season. What have you seen from him and his development? Um, I feel like Terry Young had a great offseason, so I kind of expect the way that he's playing now. I kind of expect the that he's have this season because a lot of work he's put in, how much he's improved, how much have he learned, how much have he grown, just as an individual off the field, just as much as an individual on the field. Mike Reddick? You're part of that punt return unit. Just what did you see during the week that helped you kind of get that block punt uh, when they're back up there? Um, well, our special team coach, he do a good job of, um, you know, but if his job in general, whether it be special on uh, punt return or kickoff, whatever, I feel like he do a good job. So it was it was coming. I knew it was coming eventually. So glad it happened Saturday. Good luck with Joe. Cool. The last two weeks, the uh, pass rush has really been effective. How uh, beneficial is that for you guys in the back end? Um, just being a DB in general, knowing that the pass rush is doing their job is is very beneficial. I mean, no. Every DB want their rest to do a good job because they don't have the covers long or do as much because the pass rush is being so effective. So just knowing those guys are up there doing their job makes me very happy. Let's go to look, Katie. Going against him in practice, what have you seen from Jalen Hill that's maybe allowed him to have a bigger role in the offense the last couple weeks? Um, I feel like the kid has worked, uh, you know, coming in as a freshman, you know, just me being a freshman kind of in the same position that he's in now, you know, having whether I'm going to play, whether I'm not going to play. I feel like he did a good job of just working, keeping his head down, staying grounded, um, and just working and being the best player that he can be. I feel like the kid just worked very hard and it's showing. Kennington. In addition to playing against the pass well, the cornerbacks have shown an ability to play the run very well. What's kind of gone into um, being able to execute at a high level in that area and how much pride y'all take in being able to be effective in that aspect as well? Um, well, we know we have good tackle and safety, so we cannot we make sure that us as corners, we're not being a weak link in the run game. And we know here at Alabama that being a cornerback, you're going to have to be in the run game, whether you like it or not. So you might as well get used to it and be ready to tackle when we have no problem with it. Anything else, Quinn? Awesome. Thank you.